see here. I just want to make sure that this see everything's done correct. I'm just double checking. Let's see here, looking for a pin. On the EIE cables, let's see here. They're numbered and uh, I just want to make sure that that's all connected correctly. Some we just can't tell. Hmm. Hold on then. I'm not digging that cable. And cut. Give it some power from the power unit. Make the video card on the radio on the 250 PCI. Grab a screw, grab that. At its best. We're gonna see what happens when we turn it on. Not everything. Oh shit! Get back. But before we do that, there's still a couple other components that we gotta oh. wire it into the board. Here. Last time this happened, I got burnt. You got burnt. <laughs> you know, don't want no nothing, nothing, nothing to fly out. All right, so the processor is secure. The fan supply, power supply is secure. But there's something I'm not really happy about. That I gotta pull this back up again. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> It didn't click right when I pushed it down. It should have clicked with a higher tone. <laughs> Do it again. Um, the wires, the, the wires for the fan were sitting under the processor. So oh, they, well, yeah, that's not good. All right, all right. Them two clicks is from the side, each side pieces that hold in the uh, this type of slot processor. Okay, so I've got the processor. RAM is. I didn't touch the RAM. Didn't need to. Power supply. So the motherboard is connected. Power supply to the back fan is connected. Power supply. That fan's connected. All right, then we're gonna connect the um, we're gonna connect the another fan to the motherboard. Um, it's another sysfan. The fan that we're connecting is the one that pulls in there from the front and through the case, open into the case. All right, now I'm ready to um, work on connecting up more of this board or another thing. So I want to make sure I see you got you. This wire here is gonna be going to the sound card. But I have another wire that I need to see here, and that's going to be going to the system speaker. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go ahead and put that in its place. Let's see here, a system speaker. And it's nice, these wires are nice and neatly um, labeled, so it makes it that much easier. Well, I, I got a blurry shot. Can I do that again? Uh -huh. Where is that? Oh, let me see. Yeah, focus in here is terrible. There you go, speaker. Yep. So got oh, the very good. Speaker shot, speaker wire. So I'm gonna see it. Go ahead and. Oh, that's interesting. I'm gonna find out. You gotta, you know, gotta hook that in where that goes. Hook so that in the slot wire. Say speaker. Indeed, indeed. So I got hooked up to speaker. Okay. Now I got. Let's see here. I got these other cables or these other little wires here. I'm gonna get them on there too. See. Patience, patience. These are important because you know it's reset, your hard drive, power button. So what I have is the reset switch and the power switch. And you got the power LED. But I'm only connecting what I saw was connected when um, I you know hooked it up. Let's see here. Um, okay. Alright, we're gonna put power in its place. And like I so said, this is really where having um, your motherboard manual comes handy, indeed. All right. And I'm hooking up the reset switch, so that's just in that one little area. And I also have, um, let's see, uh, I'm going to say power LED that I'm going to hook up. And all right. So I'm confident that all these little connecting wires for the power supply, hard drive, LED light, and everything are connected. Um, let's see here. There isn't much more left that we need to do to get this project started and rolling. 
Um, there's not a whole lot I'm going to do with the cables at this time. I'm just going to pretty much keep it pretty simple. So now I'm going to start installing the cards. I'm going to start with my um, video card, my Radeon 9250 PCI. So I'm going to grab a screw, I'm going to grab that, and oh, actually, I forgot. we gotta, we got to move the plates off of the case here real quick. So I'm going to slide that up, and then we're going to need one. Actually, no, I'm going to put that one back because that's for the, uh, what you call it, the uh, a port that we're not going to use or that we're going to use that one. Let's see, I'm going to skip, I'm going to skip one. Let's get another one. I think that'll work for us. All right, and I'm gonna drop these in. Okay, make sure you're grounded. I'm grounded. Da, 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 da. I'm gonna slide them in. Pretty much, if you did it right, everything should line up. And let's see. Just gently force the card into place. Make sure that it's connected to the motherboard. I like to make sure it's connected tight. And I like to grab that screw and secure it to the case. And I'm going to repeat that process a couple of times. Let's see what I got here is a sound card, so I'm going to go for it and set that one up too. I have this wire here that I want to um, connect with the sound card, so I'm going to have to do Okay. And I'm going to leave that be as it may um, and slide this down into place. It's the same type of connection, PCI. I like PCI because it's pretty common in a lot of machines. Ugh, let's see here. Alright, that card is secure. I'm going to go ahead and pull the other screw into this. Alright. And ladies and gentlemen, we are almost done. I believe we got one more card to hook up. And we got something that we could actually test. One more. One more. This is a network card. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna just blow some of the dust off of it, okay? Yeah, that did look a little dirty now. Woo! Hey, we just rolled with it. It looks dirty. <laughs> Sometimes there's some hard dust that you just can't get out. Oh well. Ah, uh, just. It's like a rag or something like that. Window. I, well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But it's the <laughs> <laughs>